In order to win votes, the ZANU-PF party, which is now in power in the province of Harare, is mobilizing an army of grassroots campaigns. 3.500 teams of door knockers have been gathered to solicit support from residents in every street and neighborhood. The campaign teams were instructed to work like mad by provincial chairman Goodwill's Masamarembua at the party meeting in Chitamaza. He said, we want to fish from the pond of the opponents. While urging the activists to stretch out and reach the masses, Masamarembua cautioned them to campaign peacefully. He claimed that President Unangogwa told the teams, we don't want any type of violence as he called for a no-violence election. At the gathering, a shocking number of over 300 citizens' coalition for change members abruptly joined ZANU-PF. Charles Tavengwa, a member of the Politburo, urged supporters to come out in mass and deliver a knockout blow for President Nguagwa and ZANU-PF. He estimated that no less than 6 million ballots would be cast in favor. Retezo Mukarati, chair of the Women's League, asked women to storm the polling places because they make up the majority of voters. Emmanuel Mahachi, the leader of the Youth League, urged upcoming voters to place their cross by ZANU-PF on the ballot. To win the hotly contested elections next month, the ruling party is making every effort. Can the army of doorknockers be sufficient to fend off growing opposition? Though, 